Hello and welcome to another edition of The Learning Project. We are so excited today to introduce you to our segment called Feeling Good and Teaching. Today we will be interviewing Ashwa Coleman, the founder of Ashwa's Conversational Pieces. Listen in and learn how you can really feel good about yourself today. It is my passion and as, and as I told you, it is literally therapy for me. Mm. So when I make jewelry for people, and I do, I, I make jewelry for women and men, but mm -hmm. I want them to feel confident, right? Mm -hmm. Because naturally, and it runs in the family, we have confidence. Mm -hmm. But I want other women to feel that, you know, that sexy place, that pretty mm -hmm. place. Yes. Um, and so that's why I started creating jewelry and different type of accessories. And also, too, for those who are shy, right? Um, yeah. So because I say my, my pieces are conversation pieces. So if you're not a talker, once you get done or once you wear my jewelry, you're going to talk, you mm -hmm. know? Mm -hmm. And so I just want to tell people, whatever style that you have, you rock that style in confidence. Because nine times out of ten, there's somebody else that um, that has that style, but they're yes. just too scared to, you know, to rock it. But yes. we're all made differently. And that's mm -hmm. what makes us unique and beautiful. Yes. I don't want to have the same style as, you know, my girlfriend next to me. Mm -hmm. You know, now there may be some things that she has that I may kind of try to, you know, maybe copy here and there, but yeah. I want to be unique in my own way. Exactly. And so I want women to, you know, to feel like if you want to rock the big hair, because, you know, normally my hair is an afro. Yes. If you yes. want to rock the big hair, if you want to rock whatever, you be confident in that. That mm -hmm. is who you are. Mm -hmm. And that's what makes you unique. Mm -hmm. And I feel as though, and I'll say this, Stephanie, when you are true to who you are, that's a type of sexiness that nobody can match. Okay. Nobody. Everything on social media is not real. Like, it's mm -hmm. okay if you're not having a good day. It's okay if you're sad. It's okay yeah. if you're angry. Yeah. It's, okay, it's okay to feel those emotions. It's, but social media will have you thinking, oh, life is perfect every day. And it's not. No. And so then you start walking in that and you're hurting yourself emotionally, mm. spiritually, mm. mentally. Mm. You're hurting yourself because you're yeah. you're trying to put this persona on Facebook and you're trying to make a reality and that's not mm. that's not and I I feel like now I have some people that told me Ashwa what are you doing you know you you know you have a glow you seem to look different because I'm working on the inside now that's it that's working it. on the inside that's it and that's inside it. is hitting a lot better. I can go work out all day long, Stephanie, mm -hmm. but if my inside is not right, I'm not going to get that same kind of glow. I want people to remember that in your own way, and I have this in my slogan, you're beautiful and you are bold in your own journey. Mm. And I want people to know, Stephanie, that we all have been called here for a purpose. Mm. And find that purpose because there's somebody out there that needs that. Yeah. Whatever that purpose is, you are doing a injustice to society and to yourself because you are you are not fulfilling your purpose. Yeah, we can go to work all day, and I grant you, I know we need to pay bills, but there's more to life than going to work. Yeah, we've been called yeah. here to do something. Yeah, and so I want your listeners to dig deep, find out what is their calling, 